of all the girls that we've seen from SAO, I think Shinon is the best girl so far. And that's kind of crazy, right? Because, like, we've had so much of Asuna and then the rest of the Cuck gang, right? Lisbeth, you know, Silica, Leafa, who's actually Sugu. And now they're just like, it's even funny last episode how, like, Kirito's getting lap pillow by blue haired Asuna. And then the Cuck gang is just like finding this plant monster who also grew wings and it's like actually more powerful now. That's like it was hilarious sometimes. But Sinon, dude. She is cracked. She's so bold. She's so strong, independent. She did like a fucking 360 nose couple of jumping off of a room. She is so cool. I just hope that she doesn't devolve into a character who needs to depend on Kirito as this show goes on. Because I have a feeling that the author kind of likes to write these characters, the girl characters, like a damsel in distress. Why can't we have a girl that saves Kirito instead? I think she's known as fantastic so far. Let's see what's going to happen in today's episode, though. Is this the uh, SAO school? There's Shinon right there, right? Yeah, that's, that's her right there. That, 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 that's her hairstyle. She has like these braids, yeah. Regular school or SAO school? Regular school probably, right? She does her own groceries. Alright, here we go. Memories of blood. Here we go. I can watch now. Whenever you see dudes like this walking around the street with like posters in the bag, like poking out, this is like... The otaku guy. Wait, is she getting bullied? She don't get bullied by these gals? She don't shoot them! But you don't really have guns here. Huh? Not gonna lie, these gotta be the ugliest representation of Gyaru gals in anime I've ever seen in my life, bro. Oh, stand up for yourself. Are they gonna fight? Gun? Wait, 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 wait! What? Is this Zaza? <laughs> no, this is not Zaza. Is she about to give Shinon a heart attack outside of the game? No, it's some random girls, right? This is some random girls. Shinon seems to be apprehensive about guns. Even though she plays Gun Gale online. This is scaring her? She got into gun violence in the past? But she actively plays a game that has guns? Zaza! Interesting. So she's scared of pistols, but she's fine with a sniper in game? Well, in game it's different. It's an actual, you know, it's, it's the game, but like, what's going on? Huh. That almost sounded like Recon. <laughs> Wait, that almost sounded like Recon. Whoever ran into the police there. Wait! This is Recon's voice! It's not Recon though. It sounded like Recon. He's a hero? In game, in game. Oh, Behemoth guy that was laughing like, ha ha ha! Ha 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 Maybe the gun will have like a blade on it. Okay, the tournament, right? The tournament. <laughs> I'm gonna kill the- High rank, high rank. So her entire thing about GGO and getting strong in-game is in order to confront her trauma, right? It's like... What's that therapy? You're like scared of something? It's, it's called shock therapy? You're like, you force yourself to like... Face your fears until you like get so normalized to it. She put all her strength points to strength. So that's the other thing. Right? Remember that guy in episode one? He's like, everybody should be investing into Aji. It's because that's like the meta. But Shinon has been putting it into strength just to be able to use Hekate because the weapon, you're, you need like high strength to use it. 
And then he was about to talk about like what the actual optimal meta was. And it's like, you fucking idiots. You spent it all on that team. When in fact, you should be using it to your personal. And then Death Gun out of short out of nowhere and then shot. And it was a heart attack. I'm going to assume her friend IRL is not an important character. Maybe he's going to be the retcon of this season. <laughs> all these people can't, you know, reset their stats. They're fucked. Oh, it's going to be a doctor? Oh, bro's fucking set for life. <laughs> this guy is so fucking tired. Is this important? He's always in game? Wait! Wait, 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 wait! Zaza! 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 Uh, doctor? Family runs a hospital? Heart attacks are happening! How? And wouldn't a person that's well suited in medicine know how to. How, how does that work though? How, how would he know how to actually use a, like a heart attack bullet? But like, you, you know the connection is kind of there, you know? It's like hospital, doctor. <laughs> is that so? <laughs> He's also very upset because Aji can't solo anymore. So he had a reason to kill a guy that, you know, was like, you use Aji only. Fuck you for, you know, and spreading, you know, that fake news. So wait, wait, I totally couldn't believe that this kid is Death Gun. It's like right in front of you but you would never notice because he's such a soft-spoken person man i don't know man i got be cautious i'm very cautious about this yeah, she cooks for herself she's an independent girl oh she cooked for him before this guy this kid this kid i don't know this kid's kind of sus now <laughs> maybe she's better if she's better she actually power crypt asuna Okay, he really wants to get with her. I don't think she's interested. That kid. Ah, I'm suspicious of him, man. Uh-oh, we know our passcode now. Awkward. No one's home. Don't say that. It's so, so depressing when you say I'm home and no one's home. Hey, service! What? What? That was sick. What's in there? The gun? This is something that she can't overcome. This is a model gun or a real gun? It's no way this is a real gun. Oh! Flashback. So, she was forced to protect herself. And even in this moment, they're actually giving us fucking thigh service. That's fucked up. So she was forced to use this gun to protect herself in the past. And ever since then, she's had this trauma of this pistol. And that's why, you know, the girls are doing this. But who did she kill? There's some guy there. Either, so, maybe some serial stalker? This is the person that we killed? She lives alone. She lives alone. Did that guy, like, kill her parents? Is that guy our dad? What's going on? Where's the mom? Don't know my dad's face. What happened to mom? Mom's always dies in anime. What's going on, mom? What are you doing? Ah! And she died here too. Unluck unlucky. Unlucky. So that was his gun. How does she get the gun? Mom's still alive. Yeah, bro is actually tweaking a lot. That's a. Oh! Yo, the kid moved. That, that she's got a. She's got the biggest balls, bro. She is like so fucking cool for doing this. Child. Toddler kid girl confronts a robber by biting him in the hand? Gun falls down! Shoot him! End him! Boom! Ooh, double tapped! Triple tapped! Quadruple.
End him. That's actually some ridiculous aim she has, bro. Like, that's crazy. Are you serious? Are The mom looks at her with disgust because she protected herself. L mom. Fuck you. And this is the stupidest anime mom. Terrible mom. Dude, just kill her right now. She knows. Shoot her. Shoot the mom too. And this is where all the trauma came from. Holy shit. Oh. That's actually so dangerous. Careful, careful, careful. That's that's two. What was the point of her taking her pants off to do all this? I feel like she only took the pants off for fan service because she and also in game just shows like, you know, thighs every single time. And yes, that is the actual gun. That makes no sense how that's an actual gun though, huh? Like, that's the exact same model from the bank robbery. But you think that the kid is just allowed to take the gun fucking home? It's a model gun? That makes a lot more sense. Cause I'm like, yo, did they just let the kid have the fucking same gun from the bank? Okay. Shinon's backstory is fucked. She might be better than every other girl in this show. But now she's saying, save me. There he is, Kirito. You're driving a motorcycle? Wait, bro has a motorcycle? What the fuck? Where did he go? Okay, okay. All right, we're leaving you, Asuna. We're going to GGO, ALO dead game. Yes. The government guy. Everything's ready for you to log into GGO. Okay. I hope they gave... So if we're converting, then we lost everything. So we're going to start fresh. So this is the first time... This is the first time Kirito is entering a game... Well, that's kind of a lie, because, like, the SAO in the beginning, he had nothing. But, like, you know, in ALO, like, he had everything, convert, like, uh, carried over. GGO fresh resets. So he's going to be a complete noob. But, like, everyone already has stats and levels. How is Kirito going to overcome this? Only items resets? So he has the stats. It's not like we could have used our fucking items in GGO either, right? Like, what the fuck are we going to do? Uh, this is hospital? Uh, Sorry, Asuna, we're gonna get a new girl. <laughs> we're gonna get new girl Shinon and the cuck trio. <laughs> the cuck trio. <laughs> the castle just like floats around like that? I thought it's like stays in one place. It just like moves around. That's kind of cool. But people are still dying. Heart attack bullet. How? <laughs> that is so cringe. <laughs> if you think it's Chuni, bro. <laughs> Kaiba! So cool. Hmm? Ooh, who are you? Nurse that we used to know? Aki is a nurse that knows us. Oh, what the fuck? That's crazy. How old is Kirito right now? He's a minor, right? Well, in Japan, if you're over 16, you're not really right. Anyways, that's crazy. She's, she's feeling up her muscles, guys. She's feeling up her muscles by grabbing her ass first. <laughs> this nurse really likes groping us, huh? Oh, backshot! Nurse backshots! Boom, boom, boom! Yeah, she's, she's checking our rehab, guys. Come on, it's important. Can we grab her ass? We can't grab her ass, right? Oh, more fan service. Boing, boing. What's the email address? Is it something funny? Dude, don't let her impulses rage out of control. She's the one assaulting us. Wait, did the government dude fucking buy him the, the motorcycle? 
Because, like, where did he get the money to buy the motorcycle? I've never seen this neat fucking work a day in his life. No, well, GGO, you can make money, but he's not playing GGO just yet. Where the fuck did he get the money for the motorcycle? Does he have an allowance for mom? Is this family just rich as fuck? This dude doesn't have a fucking job. He's never worked a fucking job in his goddamn life. I've never seen his parents yet, though. <laughs> Main character money is crazy. <laughs> I've never Damn, we've seen glances of mom here and there, but I've never like interacted directly with her. That's what I'm saying. More assault! Where is she gonna put the electrodes, huh? Oh, the nipples. Alright. Rudy is actually compared to so, like Kitty Tover. Look at this shit. What's she gonna do? She gonna she 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 gonna fucking diddle our body more than Leafa diddled our body when we logged out of ALO, bro. I don't trust her. Link start! Link start! Oh the classic screen! There it is! Ending. Uh Shinon. Who's she talking to? Uncle. Okay, so she has like an uncle that looks after her. Wait, that dude robbed a post office? Wasn't even a fucking ba- <laughs> Who the fucking am? I mean, I, I guess a bank would be more security. And a post office still has like a cash register. I think I just- <laughs> the post I don't know, something about the idea of him robbing a post office is fucking hilarious to me, bro. I thought it was a bank! Dub AC. This is Zaza! Death gun! Death gun! Interesting. Wonder why? Because it's a game? Link start! Link start! Ending. Who's this? Who's this? Zaza? Zaza? Welcome to GGO. They're dead. What is this? <laughs> the bro's profile's a cactus? Is this the doctor kid? This is the doctor kid, right? It's gotta be the medical kid. Show me your face. Uh oh yeah dox yourself give me your real name give me your S social insurance number i think it is the doctor kid right really oh no it's 100 percent the medical kid dude it is him it's the same hair all right that's the episode today's episode was not really as exciting as the previous episodes, right? But not every episode can be a banger, but, you know, it's pretty still good to kind of learn more about our main female lead in GGO. Not Asuna, definitely not fucking Leafa. It is Shinon, and Shinon has, like, a trauma from the past because she kills, uh, not a bank robber, a post office robber, just triple tapped him. Amazing fucking accuracy. But, like, this was good, but the mom, bro? I think the mom is the reason. I, I don't know. I, she was fine and then the blood pool showed up, right? It's the combination of the mom looking in disgust and the blood pool, I think, is what really just like sent her over the edge. L mom, terrible fucking mom. She should have fucking killed the mom, though, but she's done. Now she don't kind of lives her own and uncle kind of checks up on her. So she has to overcome this trauma. How? She believes that if she gets stronger in GGO, if she wins the bullet of bullets, then she should be able to overcome her trauma. Now, the trauma will probably be overcome through Kirito's intervention, right? She kind of says, someone save me. So we're kind of going back to this damsel in distress situation. But I think that she's still a very strong kid. And Shinon is like a very refreshing female character where we don't need to like... I, I think she can handle her own, right? And this fucking Aincrad castle is still baiting us, bro. When are we going to the Ruby Palace? The rest of it, uh, we're going into GGO, but it's really interesting how this guy is monitoring, you know, the group chats or whatever. And basically, this cactus guy is baiting Death Gun. He's 100% going to die. And he also has Shinon as a target. I'm not sure if this is a target to kill because the other, that was the Zexseed and the other guy that, that Death Gun killed, right? But this person right over here 
I'm not like Shinon. Why would Shinon be on the list? I thought he wants to like, I don't know, control her or something, right? Because he's super fucking creepy when not he wasn't like super creepy, but he was definitely like pushing it, right? To Shinon, like, oh, you wanna fucking walk with me back home? You wanna fucking cook for me? 100 percent it's that kid. So he is not Zaza, but presumably he is Death Gun. And I still think there's multiple death guns because they all were like a mask i feel like a death gun is some kind of cult or some kind of like guild that does this but that's for us to figure out in the future episodes but that's it for me if you're still here if you enjoyed this reaction please like the video check out the other playlist for more content and until next time take care